When it comes to climate change, we can see it with much larger storms. We can also feel it with heat waves that last longer. But now, in a paper just released from the Scripps Institution of Oceanography, scientists here say they can hear the effects of climate change in the ocean. So there's what it would sound like if a container ship's going nearby, and that, that sound's going to propagate really far. Kieran Lenson is a research and development engineer at Scripps Institution of Oceanography and collaborated on the paper. So this was a 15-year study looking at climactic and economic factors, looking at soundscapes, sound across the ocean. The ongoing research listens to natural and man-made sounds in the ocean. We're able to see blue and fin whales when they come in the area, and then when big events like uh, global recessions or a marine heat wave comes through for a few years, we can see how those populations move over time. During the ocean heat wave of 2014, a significant number of fin and blue whales left the waters off Southern California. Those levels decreased by about 50 percent, but levels at our more northern sites where it's colder, colder water, the fin and blue whale sound levels went up. Scripps designed and built the equipment. So this is our hydrophone, um, so we have a sensor up here, and these are constantly having data um, or recording sound, and it's coming down, getting amplified here, and then it gets saved in this. This is what we call our data logger. More than a half dozen pieces of equipment are located in the Bight of Southern California, collecting data nonstop, which is retrieved every six to 12 months, and the hydrophones hear everything. So this is a great example of noise pollution uh, in the Santa Barbara Channel. And this is, this is happening daily, multiple ships coming through. Which is how Scripps could hear the slowdown in the economy. So here in 2008, we hit the economic recession and this red goes down pretty dramatically. What the Scripps research does is establish a baseline for the future. This shows the importance of that 15 years so that we can see these bigger changes. With over 15 years of information collected from the oceans, the folks here at Scripps will continue to put their equipment in the ocean to listen to the data that it has to offer up. Sean Stiles, Earth 8.